These are the types of images that will dominate the next few weeks. Caps, gowns, and graduates. But four seniors on the Clay High School softball team are on a five-hour road trip west for a regional finals playoff game in Pensacola. We've been texting back and forth the whole way. All of us are super excited. We, we're ready to get there and we're ready to, we're ready to win. We, we really want this really, really badly. But to play in tonight's game, they have to miss their own high school graduation. I definitely didn't think that I would be missing graduation, but I definitely am happy that we are to continue playing the sport that we love so much. It was here on this field at Clay High School that softball brought these girls together. And they said that if they had to miss graduation, they'd rather be with their sisters on the team rather than anybody else. It was a really e easy decision for me to make. I've played with all of them since I was like eight years old and they're all my best friends. And no matter what happens in tonight's game, these best friends are guaranteed to have at least one more time together. The school is letting them walk across the stage in a special Sunday graduation. Now I'm going to bring the seniors into the gym at 7 o'clock, just like we would prior to our normal graduation. We're going to get a chance to walk through the halls, hoop and holler one more time before we head out there. I honestly think it's working out perfectly because not only do we get to go try to get a chance to go to state, we also get to invite whoever we want to our own graduation on Sunday. And it's kind of like spotlights on us a little bit. Sunday's special graduation is also open to the public, so the community can cheer on the girls who put their team first. Reporting in Green Cove Springs, Rich Donnelly, First Coast News, on your side.